huge breakthrough in my career and a certain methodology of technology in the beginning of a growth cycle of what we can do and what we can't do or what we should push ourselves to do came from all of these precursors and it was the first Terminator. Uh, the Terminator has become one of the most iconic characters in motion picture history. That chrome skull, that chrome uh, um, robot that we all have come to, to love. And based on what it was, was initially a painting that Jim Cameron had brought to me. Jim Cameron happens to be a brilliant artist. He had this character in his mind before he even wrote the script. But this endoskeleton was painted by Jim Cameron and gave me the script and I read the first Terminator and I said, this is fantastic. He initially had come to me to create the makeup effects for the Terminator. The torn skin to see the metal underneath the torn skin, the prosthetics that we would have to use to create the Terminator, the live actor Terminator losing his skin. And all of the endoskeleton was going to be done with stop motion animation. And virtually what I did was I talked Jim Cameron into allowing us, I said, Jim, I really feel that we can do a lot of this Terminator as a full size puppet using some technology that we have already developed, concepts that I'm getting into, animatronics that I want to push. And so we can, we can do a full-size, very realistic puppet that can be used for many shots. And being the visionary that Jim Cameron was, he was able to twist his mind around into, yeah, that's a good idea. And that was the development of the first Terminator, the endoskeleton, and the puppetry, the technology of the puppetry, and the pushing of the animatronics for head and neck movement and eye movement and jaw movement, but basically using Jim Henson puppet technology, we carried the Terminator, Shane Mahan, who still is with me, has been with me for over 20 years, carried the Terminator on his shoulders. He was shot from the waist up, gave him his gait, transferred into that, and we saw this organic metal, full-size, realistic Terminator robot that was virtually the breakthrough of using puppeting and our animatronic technology to create realistic characters for motion pictures.